Hi Dosto once again welcome back to the channel. This is a very quick video but informative video. If you wanted to verify any PAN of any person you can do it online itself. What are the data you need is PAN number and complete name. Okay we can see whether PAN exists or there is some problem with the PAN. So this can be done from the latest income tax portal which was just launched some days back. So as you can see income tax.gov.in this is the url of the website i will be giving this url in my video description you can just copy paste in your mobile browser after that if you scroll down you get an option verify your pan this is the option you are going to click here okay once you click you are supposed to enter the details of the pan and person to verify it what are the details you need mainly you need a pan number and after that a full name of the person and date of birth and mobile number these are the data you are going to give online after entering all this you are clicking on continue button okay so it's very quick and simple but there are still some issues you have to face or you have to take care let me show you a live example i put it as a pan number here after that the full name usually this is an example it will be like this first name and second name and last name okay usually indian names will be almost similar to this and we enter usually like this first name second name last name and date of birth and mobile number and after that we are going to click on continue let us see what happens here when you click here if the name is right okay but the order can be wrong that is the problem because in pan the order may be wrong i will show you what happens there is an otp coming on your mobile after entering these things I enter the OTP here you will uh, get an SMS linked to the mobile whatever mobile link to the PAN okay enter the OTP and after that scroll down and click on validate button this is the procedure procedure is very simple but uh, you remember you have only three attempts for OTP okay otherwise it will lock out okay please remember that I click on validate I got a message like this PAN is active but details are not as per PAN what is the problem here PAN is active but details are not right okay if you get any message like this that just means the order of name is wrong example is here pan holder if you check in the pan it will be first name middle name and last will be the surname so you have to enter the same way what you see in the pan okay one two three the same order should be given in the website also while verifying the pan then it will work okay so whatever given in the pan if pan contains first name middle name surname you give the same order in this website also otherwise it will say a uh, data mismatch pan exists but data is mismatch okay remember this first name middle name surname whatever given in the pan what is the first name in pan give it here second name in pan give it here third name whatever in the pan the same order you give it here and after that again you are going to get an otp the same procedure i am entering the otp after entering otp uh, come back bottom of the screen you can click on continue button let us see what happens if you are giving pan number and the order of the name as right what is the message it gives click on validate now let us see what happens when i click on validate with the right order of my name okay the right message comes you can see here pan is active and details are as per pan that means things are right here because you have given the correct pan number and as well as the order of name is as per your pan card this way you can confirm whether pan is valid or and data in the pan and the web portal is in the right order thank you so much if you like the video kindly give us a like also please share and subscribe see you with another important video thank you so much